Hi there, um, this is the uh, first clip in a series of uh, uh, YouTube's clips try to uh, illustrate and explain in detail how to use the SPSS to perform some statistical analysis. SPSS stands for statistical package for social science however recently the name was changed to statistical product and surface solutions when you uh, start the program you will see two screen output actually the first one is containing the data the second one will show you your output of analysis if we go back to the data itself there is two view there is data view and the variable view if we start here the files the most important orders here is open data or save the data For edit, the most important one is either to insert variable or cases, and the option where you can change the font, the, la the language of the program, the shape of the table. View is not that very important here, except this order here this value label is very important however it has a shortcut here it can show you your coding for variable for example six here was coded for one and two one for male two for female just hitting this button here will show you the variable itself data you can sort the cases and you can even choose more than variable to sort the cases you can sort it first by the age and then by the sex even you can sort the variables merge file is different than aggregate merge file that mean you are adding to your file more cases or variable while aggregate you are combining two files in one now for split file this is different than sort the cases A split file mean telling the spss to deal with the data as two different files but analyze both of them together for example let us sort our file here based on the sex see what happened so he will tell me here in the output that he did that going back to the data view itself it is written down here that the file is split by sex so let us say that you want to uh, do some basic descriptive uh, descriptive statistics for the age and you want the mean the start of the behavior for example go okay go to the output for your result as you can see here he dealt with it into whether it is male or female it is very crucial to go back and to do unsplitting if your job is done or 
can go analyze all the cases now for select cases is different you are telling SPSS to omit the cases so let us say that we are going to select just the male so equal to one and by the way if you forgot how did you code it just right click over the variable go variable information and you remember it one and two so when you continue you'll see that he start to omit all the variable even the next one so if you are going to order analysis for example the same statistics frequency the age again the output is just for the male he will not even mention anything about him now again go back and select all the cases all the cases okay so that trick mark is gone the last thing in the data is weighting the cases so instead of spreading the whole data you can just summarize it and this is very important for categorical uh, statistical analysis we'll have so many examples of all that later on so i'm going to conclude uh, this uh, first part of our introductory sessions how to use the spss now and hopefully we'll meet together later on